7.56 and I have my first class at 8 o'clock and I thought it'd be a fun idea to do a little day in my life as an online kid who doesn't doesn't really feel like she goes to school. It's kind of like a podcast, like a fun little activity for me. It's weird. I thought it'd be fun to show you guys what I do in a day because it, it's, it's a lot different from last year. Also, um, you guys are getting two YouTube videos this week because I missed last week. And the only reason why I missed it is because I was moving back into my grandparents' place and getting ready for school. But I had one fully filmed and ready to go. I just couldn't upload it because I wasn't able to be by, com by my computer for long enough to get it to upload. I'm really tired, <laughs> but it's okay. Anyways, um, my first class is math, and I'm not very good at math, but um, I only have two Zoom calls today, which is pretty nice, and they're all in the morning. I have math till 9.15, and then I have English till... 10.30, which is kind of fun. And then, what else do I need to do today? Um, I haven't really got any assignments or anything like that because it's the first week and pretty much it's just like reading the syllabus and that kind of thing and like teachers introducing themselves because the way that my school works is we have, we don't have Zoom calls every day. I think for each of my classes, I only have three. Um, I maybe have two Zoom calls a week for each class, and a lot of them land on the same day. So, honestly, not bad whatsoever, but, um, math, this is the first Zoom call, and it's Thursday. So I don't think I'm getting any assignments today. I don't think I really, my brain doesn't need to be fully prepared. I woke up this morning a little late. I try to wake up at 7, you know, to, like, have a good routine, but this morning I was just really tired. And so I let myself sleep until 7.30. And then I laid in my bed for another 10 minutes. And then I decided to get up and get a coffee. And now my Zoom call is almost starting. I also, I was struggling trying to sign into my Zoom call the other day. Yesterday, actually. It was a fucking hassle. It stressed me out. Okay, guys. I just finished my math Zoom call, which was really fucking stupid. It was just introduction, um, because it is like the first week of school, and the way it's set up is like, introduction day for all the classes are different, because of wherever your Zoom call lands. Um, so yeah, but now I have English, and English is also an introduction. Um, I have a feeling that my English class is going to be a little bit of a bitch, but it's fine. Because I like English. That's the only class that I'm actually good at, other than the art classes. Okay, I'm gonna make another coffee. Because I feel like I'm gonna fucking pass out right now. Maybe, Chloe, maybe you can make yourself some food. That might be a good idea. But it's too early to eat food right now. I've, ugh, God. I feel ill. <laughs> I feel sick. <laughs> okay, I'll be back. <laughs> While I'm waiting for my English class to start, I am going to pick out some outfits for TikTok. Because I have nothing better to do. <laughs> Normally, if I had schoolwork, I'd be doing school right now. But since it's the first week and I don't have any, um, I'm going to pick out outfits. And yeah. shirt and I have no idea where it is. I'm so confused. Where did I put it? I have no idea. It's just like a simple black ripped tank top but I don't know where it is. I'm very confused right now. I found it. It was literally where I was looking for it. That's embarrassing. Whatever. Whatever.
Guys, okay, so I'm answering some emails for like social media and this fuck, I'm so obsessed with this brand. Oh my god, I'm so excited right now. Um this brand called My Mom Made It asked to send me some of their pieces and like I'm looking through everything and I literally like it's simple and like it kinda reminds me of Brandy Melville, but like elevated. Better. Better. Better for the environment ethically made like oh my god um you'll see more of it on my tiktok probably in like two weeks or something like that depends on when it gets to me but um if you're someone who likes like the clean girl aesthetic or like the brandy melville simple aesthetic this brand is for you i don't think people understand the joy i have like i get when i see like a small designer and like their stuff is actually really cool and i can just see them being really successful that's how i feel right now about this brand like Oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> Um, did tech talks and now I'm gonna go to the coffee shop and do some school work and um, that's pretty much it that's all I gotta do today so I'm gonna go spend $8 on a latte and sit in a coffee shop in my cute little outfit <gasps> let me show you let me show you what I'm wearing because I'm kind of it's kind of my favorite outfit I'm not gonna lie I really love it I can fucking move all this shit out of the way so I can fucking toss you up here. Oh fuck. This is what I'm wearing. Cute, right? My boots. Um, this shirt is just a cut off black tank and then this I thrifted. This is my grandma's. The necklace I got in Paris from this street artist and then the pants I thrifted. And my shoes are public desire. These are probably my favorite shoes. I love them so much, but they're way too big for me, but I pretend that they're not too big for me. You know what I mean? And the rings are all cheap, shitty rings from like H&M because I lose them. And then my earrings are every jewels. And that is what I'm wearing to the coffee shop. I'll see you guys there. Hey guys, I'm back from the coffee shop and I literally, I did so much work. I feel insane. I accidentally had um, a quadruple shot espresso latte. I don't know why I said it like that, but I had way too much coffee and I didn't mean to. I, I thought it was a regular latte, just like a bigger size, like more milk or something. You know what I mean? That's usually what most coffee shops do, but no, they did the full four shots and I, I, I've, I, <laughs> I'm glitching. I'm glitching a little bit. God, I have too much caffeine in me to even function. Um, anyways, with my school, you can get ahead if you want to. Um, so that's fantastic. And tomorrow's Friday, and I'm getting my hair done tomorrow, which I'm very excited for because I don't like my hair being long. I like it short. And some people might think that this is short, but this is too long for me. This, it's too long because my hair is really thick, and then it's just like... I don't know how to explain it. Also, my hair falls out. My hair used to be very healthy, but um, for certain reasons, it's not so healthy anymore and it falls out. So I like to keep it short because it makes it look like I have more hair. You know, I'm hiding, I'm hiding the fact that I am, I can't say that word. We're not gonna get into it. <laughs> We're not gonna get into it. But um, anyways, for right now, I'm back from the coffee shop. I finished social media things and I'm doing a really cool couple little, deals like some really cool brands are sending me clothes and I'm very excited for that so I spent 20 minutes answering those emails and then I finished editing my YouTube video and then I figured out my fashion course because for some reason I kept getting logged out but it's okay I called the school about it and I'm fine now and I can do the work so I'm gonna do that tonight and then I have some more school and then I I'm gonna try and get this all done by six before dinner time so then for the rest of the day I can just chill and like clean my room up a little bit um, and then play Mario Kart. That's my plan for tonight. I really want to play Mario Kart. 
I haven't played it in like two days. I'm Mario Kart is literally my favorite game in the entire world. <laughs> and I play the I play the easy one, like the slow speed, so I can just I'm always winning and it's relaxing to me. Even if I get hit by a shell, it doesn't matter because I'm like literally fifty feet in front of everybody else because it's the slow, easy speed that everybody wins. And that's why I like playing Mario Kart. But when I'm in a funky mood, I play the hard speeds, but that's rare. Because I normally play Mario Kart just to relax my nerves, distract me from what's going on inside of my brain. Anyways, um, okay, I'm gonna do some school. You're gonna get a little montage. I didn't film inside the coffee shop because I was uncomfortable and um, I was already in like a wild outfit and people were already looking at me and I didn't wanna fucking pull out a camera filming myself on my computer. I didn't wanna, I didn't wanna do that. I, I didn't wanna put my social anxiety through that so I decided not to. But yeah, you're just gonna have to believe me that I did a lot of things at the shop. Also, if, no, I can't tell you where I went because what if there's a creepy person and they come to my town because it's only one block. There's one block in this town so I'm not gonna tell you where I went because that scares me. Um, I'm going on a random tangent. I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get my thoughts in place with my little planner and then I'm gonna do some schoolwork and then Hopefully that will go by fast and it will be dinner time. And I think my grandpa and I are having salmon. My grandma's in the city, she left me. She left me, but it's okay, because then I got to steal her jewelry and she's never gonna know. I am gonna put it back though. I took a picture of where I found it and I'm gonna put it back in the exact position that it was in. And if it's not and she questions, I'm gonna blame it on my grandpa because that's what I always do. And he takes the blame for me, even though he knows that I was the one who touched her stuff. <laughs> So my grandpa's a, my grandpa's a G. Anyways, what was I doing? Where was I, what was I doing? Right, planning, okay. <laughs> I'm gonna turn this off because I keep getting distracted. Um, KK, um, CFs. It's gonna be a montage. So I'll talk to you in a hot second. <laughs> So, my camera died while I was sitting outside, but I just finished some stuff for my business class, but I wanted to show you guys how I stay on top of online school and how I plan because the online programs that I do are very independent learning. I'm pretty much my own teacher, and if I have a late assignment or something, they're not going to say anything to me because they have 50 other kids that they need to worry about in their class because it's online and there's a lot of people doing online. Um, so you have to be very, what's the word? What's the word responsible? So I'm gonna show you how I plan and this could honestly help you with normal high school or just like whatever, but I get overwhelmed very easily and if I'm not constantly planning my day and updating my calendars and everything, then I get stressed and I get a lot of anxiety and when I get very overwhelmed like with school or something then I I don't do it because just like thinking about it gives me so much anxiety so planning things out make me feel better first um, I always like to have two planners I have a daily planner and then I also have a weekly planner and I got my daily planner from chapters it literally has goals for the day today's task today's menu and hydration and exercise song of the day notes I don't use the menu or the exercise or the song of the day. I only use the goals for the day and today's tasks. And then if I have more to write down, I just take up the spaces for exercise and today's menu. But if you wanna do the today's menu thing, then like go for it. But I personally don't like those features <laughs> in these fucking calendars. I don't know why they put that there, but whatever. I bring my daily planner with me everywhere. Like when I went to the coffee shop today, I brought this with me and in the morning, I look at my weekly planner and I also look at my calendar with my online program and I fill out the today's task and then I put it to most important to least important and things that I need to focus on and things that once I finish the tasks that are important, I can go to the ones that aren't so important. Um, and I also like to put like my schedule for school because my Zoom calls and everything change every day. It's not the same. 
so I just like to put my schedule on there and then I have like two separate things on my today's task so I have like social media or like personal things that I need to do and then I also have school things that I need to do and it just makes me feel better and less overwhelmed and I don't overdo it in a day that's something that I've always had a hard time with is I try to fit too much in in one day and it fucking stresses me out um so that's why I do most important to least important and then I can focus a lot better on what I need to do but yeah I do that every morning and then for my daily not my daily my weekly planner I plan on Sundays for everything that I need to do which is nice that's when I clean my room it's like a Sunday reset that's when I plan for everything so I plan for like YouTube or social media things or like personal things and then I also plan for school anyways that's how I plan for everything and all of my planners and notebooks and everything are from chapters hey guys um i'm back so i did about an hour of my fashion course and i am fucking exhausted i'm tired oh i'm tired but it's okay though i actually like being busy throughout the day because then it helps me sleep better because i have really bad sleep insomnia and for me to have a good sleep i need to burn myself out in a day you know what i mean i don't think that's normal but whatever um I'm not going to show you guys my, like, nighttime routine because it's 9 o'clock and I try and be in bed by 10 and my nighttime routine is, like, my me time and I feel like having a camera with me doesn't really feel like me time, you know, which I mean, but normally I just clean up my room for tomorrow and then, um, plan for the day. I already did that though so I don't really need to do that and I shower and do my skincare and I pass out and I go to sleep. But before I go to sleep though I play Mario Kart. Always. Always. I always play Mario Kart. I need to go to sleep. I feel fucking, I don't even, I'm tired. Okay. I'll see you guys next Sunday. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you liked it. Bye.